Hey guys, this is Amanda. I'm kind of new here. Well, kind of. I just got out of the shower. As you can see, I have wet hair. But um, I'm going to do my skincare now. And what I'm doing is just using up stuff that I already have. It's simply because there are things I have noticed while I watch back my videos, because I have to edit, because I say the F word a lot. Um, uh, I'm going to just do this while I chat with you. But uh, yeah, so I, I've i noticed that there are things about my body that I don't care for. This is something that can be fixed by changing my habits. See, one thing you guys may or may not have known is prior to the pandemic, I... Okay, we'll go long history. I've always had an issue with weight. Well, I haven't had an issue. There's other people who've had an issue with weight. Um, I just have always been heavy. Always. And it's not bothered me that much until I was diagnosed with a chronic illness in 2010. So that's uh, 11, about 11 years ago and uh or nearly 11 years ago and so then i started thinking about my health why because i got a kick in the pants and uh well since 2014 i started taking my fitness even i i changed my eating habits in 2010 started doing water aerobics because uh, I was diagnosed with MS in 2010. To me, not a big deal anymore because, you know, I've got it. I've had it for a decade. Um, but so I started doing water walking and other fitness things like a land aerobics class, a dry, dry aerobics class and a water aerobics. So there's two kinds of aerobics, the, flu the wet kind and the not wet. So the, yeah, anyway, um, Sorry, I have stuff on my chin that I didn't realize. So anyway, it progressed from doing that uh, water aerobics and uh, uh, like a senior citizen aerobics class to Zumba to a year ago. We had our last fit class, our, our hit class, hit. That is high intensity interval training. I was doing that and Honestly, guys, during that whole time, I went from being couch potato Amanda to, and yuck, to myself yuck. My husband still loved me. We met in the time where I was not um, in excellent shape to being in the best shape I have ever been to being able to outlift lots of people except my husband who had uh, the ability to do bench presses better than me and I don't like it. He could still do out, out bench me. It bugs me. I let my old habits in the last year, I let my old habits come back. I've been sitting at home being angry, watching TV, because I'm afraid, because I know I have a compromised immune system because of my meds. I know that I uh, couldn't go to the gym because here in my state, we just don't wear masks. There's too many people who say, you, you're not going to stomp on my rights. Uh, I'm a selfish butt face with the whole anti-mask thing and our gym does not make people wear masks. So I, uh, chew, I let my old habits back. I went back to sitting on the couch, watching TV, really more watching the news and freaking myself out. That's what happened to watching YouTube uh, and freaking myself out because, you know, I started watching things like prepper videos and that's I don't need that. But anyway, I've noticed the things montage again of. See. Uh, those are the things that I don't like about my body. So, with today being March 1, I'm just letting you guys know that I need accountability. 
and so let's do this. I will post a short every day for March 1 and uh, here, no, here. Well, there, over the dresser. That's where I am going to put my drawers open. I didn't notice that before. Um, these are my stats. Everything that I get from my bathroom scale. And well, guys, let's do this. Since the beginning of the year, I have been able to gather up what I need for a home gym and I'm just gonna do it. And so you guys get to be my accountability. That's the one thing I miss about a gym is I miss the community, the, the accountability. Let's do this. So every day I'm going to post a short telling you, showing you what I did and uh, probably breathing hard. So this is my March challenge. New habits. Okay, guys, if you want to join along, if you have any advice, encouraging words, if you have, if, let me know. Because, well, I don't want to be alone in this. And I can't be the only one out there, right? Okay. All right, we'll see you guys later. Bye.